if you guys think I'm naked, like I'm not, I'm wearing a undershirt under this. So yeah, just in case you were wondering, like I'm not naked, I just, I'm freezing. Hello everyone, it's Jasmine here, and if you're wondering why I'm wearing a robe, it's because it's absolutely freezing in here. It is now 11 o'clock, and I've been waiting for it to get lighter or something, but that doesn't seem to be happening, so here we are, and I'm sorry if it's like incredibly dark, but sunlight is just not happening today. Today I am going to be doing a holiday gift card for girls. Um, I, some of these things are unisex, but, um, most of it is just for girls. So yeah, let's just get started with this gift guide for girls. So the first thing on my list is a Polaroid camera. Oh my gosh. I would definitely recommend getting somebody a Polaroid camera. I'm sure they would love it. And make sure you get them film because, because I'm not sure if all of them come with it, but I know in the mini one it comes with like 10 like, I don't know what you call them, photo things? I don't know, it only comes with 10 of those. So make sure you get them some film with it. Or I would also suggest getting um, a portable printer that prints the Polaroid pictures. Or you can get a digital one, that would be even cooler. But, cause like, you don't wanna mess up your pictures and then it just prints it out right away and then you don't want and the film's like, So I would just, would really recommend either getting the digital one or get the actual print. Next thing I have on my list is nail polish. What girl doesn't love nail polish? I don't know. But for the girls who love nail polish, get them like little nail polish sets. You can get them little SE nail polish sets or like Sally Hansen or Sephora. I don't know, like those expensive ones. But if you want to go cheaper, just stick with like the SE or something. Trust me, it's all the same. A jewelry holder. A jewelry holder can help a girl out so much. Like if you know they have stacks of jewelry and they just keep it in a little box, get them a jewelry holder. You can either make your own, um, like either using like um, like a picture frame and putting cork boards inside it and have the pins in it and you can just hang your necklaces up like that. Or you can get like um, like three plates and have this like kind of three tiered, th three tiered thing. You can go to the thrift shop or go to the regular store, I don't know. And then get three plates and then two like glasses that can hold them up. I will have like a picture over here. So yeah, those are like pretty awesome gifts. Next is bath bombs. If somebody is obsessed with having baths and just loves to have like to maybe pamper themselves one night a great gift idea is a bath bomb and the ones I would suggest would be at Lush okay I love getting my mom gifts but I usually tend to get her the same things every single time one year I had an idea to mix it up again to mix it up a bit and I decided to get her um, a Lush set and it had like the little bubble bar bath bomb and then like shower gel and this is like the twilight one or something it was like a lavender kit um and it was called relax and my mom is obsessed with it like i'm telling you obsessed with it like you know how you drop the whole bath bomb no she's chipping it off piece by piece there is still some left till this day and i got it for her birthday in july so another homemade thing you can do is make your own homemade bath scrubs or salt scrubs or like um you can make your own bath bombs even like there's so many videos online where you can make your own stuff and it is like it's a really cheap and affordable gift but you can make it like in a little jar and you can like tie it up with a ribbon or something and it'll make it look so cute like honestly those things are like the best things and then you can also have like the ingredients on the thing so if they want it, like if they run out they can just make some more on their own right and it'll be like perfect this next one is a sentimental gift and it is a 52 things about you and or 52 things that I love about you, right? So if you um, don't have a lot of money but you want to make a sentimental gift, this is perfect. All you need to do is get a deck of cards and cut out 52 uh, little squares of paper and then on the front of it, you write 52 things I love about you and throughout the book it will have things that you love about them and they'll know how like heartfelt it was and all you need to do is punch two holes in every single card and put rings through it so it's like a little booklet and they could read it and they'll be all happy and they'll be like oh my gosh this is like the best gift I ever had in my life and ow and you'll be ready to go. A portable charger. Honestly if you know somebody well actually anyone who has a phone or like an iPod or an iPad or something, get them a portable charger, honestly. It is such a lifesaver. And make sure it's nice 
and small because I had one and it was gigantic and it was so heavy it was making my purse weigh an extra like 10 pounds and I stuffed my purse to the max so I wasn't about mm -mm. I couldn't handle it anymore but sometimes I would always forget to charge it but a portable charger is awesome 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 gift idea now another thing another idea that's a more sentimental gift um is like stuff in a jar or a basket of stuff like you've seen all those things in a jar where it all like corresponds with each other so like it'd be like a basket full of makeup or a basket for guys that has a whole bunch of shaving creams and like tools or something like honestly i think that's an amazing gift because you have a jar like get a big jar or a big basket and just put every single thing you know that they love in it like even like just just even a little bit of it so like if it's like uh they like some candy put some of that in if they like um go into the movies make a movie one and have like a popcorn thing like i saw that online it looks so cool like make a jar with all their favorite things that corresponds to them if it's like makeup get them some makeup some mascara some lipstick everything like honestly things in a jar are like the cutest things and it just like relates to the person and it shows them how much you know them and how much you love them so like that's perfect anything in a jar or a basket is awesome another idea is to get somebody a onesie onesies are the cutest thing and make sure you get one with feet things like i know when you go to the washing me at the zip the whole thing and it's just such a big process but honestly onesies are amazing i have a unicorn onesie mm, beautiful love it and that's all the gift ideas i have for you guys please what was this if you enjoyed this video definitely give it a thumbs up i am definitely thinking of doing well vlogmas is already passed but Honestly, I was really thinking of doing Vlogmas this year, but I am a student and I still got a high school and I don't do any uh, and I don't do anything interesting. Like honestly, you'd just be seeing me in the morning and the afternoon. I don't do anything interesting. I just like do my homework and go to bed. Like <laughs> So I was thinking of doing it over my break. So like so I, like I'd be filming every single day on my break because I'd probably actually be doing something every single day. So yeah, I'd film like my New Year's and my Christmas. And yeah, so hopefully I will be doing that. So hopefully I will see you then. But if not, I will definitely be doing my um my what I got for Christmas video. I do that like every single year. But yeah. Hope you all enjoyed this video. Hopefully it gave you some ideas, some inspiration. If you weren't sure what to get somebody, I hope this helped you out. So thank you all for watching. I hope you all enjoyed and bye.